forgot to hit fucking record. Well, uh, fourth time's the charm. Anyways, welcome to uh, World of San Andreas. A look at water. Whoa, where did the fish pop in? And, uh, you know, I, I... This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to talk about the waters and see how this island is kind of like Atlantis of the Pacific. Uh, in the last episode, I had a long epi long talk uh, about what is this place in relative, maybe maybe this could be an island between Hawaii and California. The geology is more towards a Pacific island, but the weather is more of a temperate, not a temperate, but a uh, warmer climate than say, or uh, not, uh, less tropical than than um, than Hawaii, but then if you put that there, you're looking at maybe Easter Island and and some of the Mar um, Micronesian Islands. And so, anyways, go back, watch that. Um, you know, got this on the playlist. I probably have to redo the playlist. But we're in a submersible here, off to our left, uh, in the bottom corner there. We got our depth and feet. Uh, how much feet is above us? We are nice cruising at 315 feet down. And... What was that? Uh, and the sun seems to be coming down. So we are... It's gonna get dark. So let's cruise down here. Um, again, this is a uh, pretty unnormal to have li this, this life here. In Hawaii, uh, black coral is down this deep. Um, black coral is a coral known to be deep. Uh, very, it's kind of like a it's a jewelry used for jewelry. Very expensive stuff. It, it, it's 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 not a good. It's it's I, it's a very dangerous job because how the human body is not designed to go down to four hundred feet daily. Um, like, let's look at these these coral formations. Very interesting coral formations we're having here at 450 feet. Um, it's hard coral, and that's soft coral, which is very very weird. Um, going back to my uh, hypotenuse of the square root, my hypotenuse. Fuck it, you know what I mean. Yeah, where this might be an alien island. Um, there's been rumors and all that stuff. So we're just cruising around here looking at some, maybe we could see some fish here. Kind of deep, maybe we'll go more inland. What's that? Uh, there is no first person camera, in it, and so I'm very, very upset about that. I sent an email to Rockstar saying, no first person camera. Um, uh, they said, uh, who the fuck are you? And I said, who the fuck are you? And then, um, and then that happened. That didn't happen. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't like to lie. Let's see here. We we got a nice cluster. Maybe we can find a like a seal down here. Let's see here. Anything? Let's turn off the lights. See if we can. Anything? Anything? Whoa! Rock formation here. It seems like. Uh, whoa! Oh, is this a face? I think this is uh, Abe Lincoln's face right here to our left. Yep, this is uh, definitely Abe Lincoln's face. Nope, nope, that is a that's uh that's um, um Sun Yat Sen, a re Chinese revolutionary and uh, an alien. So we have proof that Chinese may have been here, um, and that their aliens uh, could have been here. So definite proof on that maybe. Also, maybe Half-Life 3 confirmed. Um, so, so there's a maybe. We have confirms of maybes. Whoa. What is this? This looks like a, uh, a rock formation. Interesting, interesting. We don't see type of this rock formation down in the water. It, it's... But it... Whoa, whoa. Turning off lights. We got some glimmer here. This could be a rare metal. It's this, uh, this could be gold, it could be feldspar. Let's see if we can get a nice, nice, nice look here. We're at 100 feet, we should be be seeing some, 
it's a, a hardcore of the villain. It is a weird island where light seems to penetrate water a lot better than, say, in other parts of Earth. Very interesting here. What's that? So we're, we're now starting to see some tropical fish. Again, we're, we're at 76 feet. Seems to be more kelp. Okay. We're slowly making our way back down the coast. Um, very interesting. Oh, there's the surface right there. Okay, it looks like we have a sandbar here. Let's go back down. Now, the submersible has enough oxygen to last for six months, and food to last me zero days. So, so it should be fun. And again, that, that oxygen lasts for six months as long as they come up for air. So, so I can replenish my tanks if I bought surface. Uh, past six months, I need to replace the filters. Let's see here. It's a nice, nice uh, soft coral here. Um, a little bit of hard coral. Little ferns and stuff. Very, very, very interesting. Um, there doesn't seem to be much coral for the eight. I'm dating this age a good hundred thousand years. Um, no, it, it's greater than that. Five hundred thousand years on uh, the the surfacing of this island. So we should be able. And maybe last eruption. Maybe. Um, maybe. 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 maybe uh, Four thousand years ago. So we should be seeing coral, especially on this side. Um, so there, there should be coral development here, and I think it might be because of the iridium in the in the in in the water, or it could also be the pollution. It goes back to um, the pollution. So we are just cruising here, looking for looking for anything. Uh, water seems to be getting a little hazy here. Oh, what is this? What is this? Is this a crop circle? No, that's just a little basin here. This is very interesting. This rock formation here. This um, very interesting. Let's, uh, huh, very interesting, very interesting, what is this, why is this black here, this, this another good documentary in DDC is called The Abyss, uh, James Cameron's epic tale of, uh, Ed Harris going down deep, and rats, and all sorts of cool stuff, but a lot of that technology in that movie is true, um, about it. Um, about uh, breathing water through your lung or oxygenated water. Anyways, it's a, it's a good movie. Not for my tree, it's just, blah, blah, blah. This is interesting. More more soft corals, more algae, uh, kelp. Very deep. Um, hmm. Looking for some alien, maybe? Aliens. Always good. So we're going to go a little bit deeper, see if we can get down to this uh, trench here. So this is where the island seems to be um, coming off the plate um, in just a sheer, sheer drop off. Oh, here we go. We got some, this is some hard coral here. We haven't seen this up close, up, up near the surface. So let's see if we can get a better look on this. If I had some scuba gear, this would be great. Uh, maybe take some samples. Seems to be algae growth on it. Again, very, very interesting. As we are very deep. We're at uh, 400 and, uh, and uh, 60 feet. Uh, and there's still some stuff. There's still still some stuff here. Let's, so let's turn on some lights here. So how are we moving? Uh, yeah, we're slowly moving on. This is going to be a little bit extra long level. Oh, we got some uh, bottom fish here. So this would probably be good diving, or, or not good diving, horrible diving. There's nothing to see here. Besides the, the helicopter I crashed into the water. What the fuck was that? Oh. Uh, but, so the best diving, deep diving fishes are in Hawaii and... Deep fish, deep water fishing is in Hawaii and off the coast of Chile because oh wow this is this is a sheer cliff now this is weird so we have some water erosion here so maybe maybe this island used to be up above the water maybe an ice age happened here um 
very interesting or aliens this could be this could be yes this this is this is a definitely proof of a maybe again definitely proof so so this is hard rock this is this is definitely basaltic very basaltic uh, not a vinegar it's a type of oceanic crust unlike andesite which is found in uh, places like uh, uh, Washington Mount St. Helens it's very a lot of lot less silica I think it is or so it has to do with the silica oh wow that, that look at that so so if I if I had a scuba gear scuba gear let's see there was a nice fern coral there yeah look at that look at, isn't that gorgeous Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. This thing is not easy to control. They, the simulator back at the college does not. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Drop it down. Look at that coral. Oh, let's see here. Wow, beautiful, beautiful. We're seeing something coming in from the right here. Are you guys picking this up on the stream? Fish passing through the 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 water there. Very, very could be something. Is there a light coming around? Okay, that's my light. So okay, let's turn off the lights. See if we can find the lights. We're finding a lot of metals, shiny metals. So this is very interesting. Very interesting. I haven't been down this long. Oh, long. It's it, we're going on eleven minutes. Um, auction levels. Let me look at the auction levels. They look fine. Um, again. Need probably need to surface soon or I'll die. Again, more more lava flow here, but on the land it doesn't seem like it. It could be a lot of current running through here. Hmm. Maybe maybe the waves. The waves in San Andreas tend to be pretty rough. For not very uncommon. So let me let me just um surface here. We'll get a better look at these um. The water here so it's it's not it's not flat you see it's not flat it, it it's not a breath of wind the skies are a little bit cloudy so I don't know where this where this um um this waves are coming from so let me check the, let me check my weather facts in here I got my weather facts in here that is literally a real thing shit you not so let's uh, let's see the weather here um Let's see here. Yeah, it should be clear all day. Um, sunrise at six in the morning. So here we go. Oh god, look at these these weird rock formations I've encountered. These jettison rocks. Not natural. I'm surprised I haven't seen any caves on this side, but maybe on the other side there might be caves. I don't know. Maybe maybe in another segment. Um, a yeah, little, little bit of a drop off here. Could be subterranean water flows. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is that? What is that? This is, this is definitely, this is definitely natural. But why is it happening here? This seems like maybe, okay, so I don't know if you could pick this up on the video feed people, but there is a blurring effect happening. Especially down here. It could be the fresh water fresh water coming in and it erodes fresh water is lighter is less dense than than salt water so what is what's it doing is a little underwater river run right through here so you can see right there you can see right there you see that's that smoke I popped up pop yeah there we go oh god this is this is groundbreaking I am getting I'm getting some degrees out of this my dis my dysentery uh, definitely it's gonna get cleared up after this and uh, wow I'm getting my dysentery cleared about um, dysentery get my dysentery going so we're finding all sorts of stuff I hope you guys are enjoying this I have a raging boner for this right now excuse my language I am so sorry that is not appropriate but Jesus look at this oh god what is this is that a dildo no no that's just uh, some hard coil um, I, I, I play too much Saints Row. That dildo bat. Whoa, holy shit! 
What the fuck? I this is actually uh very interesting. I have never seen anything like this. This is a fucking gas tank in the middle of fucking the ocean. Now this brings back to the very controversial topic of pollution. So does it seem to be leaking? It, it's very interesting. Wonder if I can. Is there an opening in there? There is an opening. Interesting, interesting. I kind of want to risk it, but not, not risk it. Maybe, maybe on the way out we'll see what happens. I, I might die. It could be an abandoned um, underwater tank, or not an underwater tank, but a, a, a water lab. Oh, there's even a ladder there. What the fuck? Do I got my high beams on? Yeah. Very interesting. So somebody put this here. This is a... Very interesting. Okay, where were we, where were we off? We're kind of entering Los Santos, sir, uh, the beachfront right now. This seems... And there's a fucking lot. Is that a... Weird. I've never encountered this. I've, I've done a million trips through here. I've never really seen anything except for aliens. Interesting. There seems to be a... Uh, um, a this, this seems like this used to be above ground. This definitely used to be above ground. I'm hearing clickings. Are you guys picking this up? I don't know what's going on. Um, calm, sonar. Sonar, ching, ching. Do a ping, please. Okay. This is a uh, very interesting. Let me go down a little bit deeper. Maybe we might find something else. We're we're pretty deep here. Oh, okay. So what's going on is uh, that I'm hearing sounds, and that's just my uh, the submarine buckling. So we're pretty good. Yeah, just the pressure difference. Yeah, a very interesting to find I've have here. Let me just uh, let me just uh, make a note here. Um, you know. This is very interesting. Very interesting. And it seems to be wood here. In very good condition, too. That's really weird. Um, uh, wood would have been usually decays within a, a couple uh, months when underwater. Uh, especially in salt water. In fresh water, it's fine. Salt water fucks everything up. Excuse my language. Excuse my language. Seems like it may be, maybe there's some sort of structure here and it fell down. But of course, this has to be above water. Interesting, interesting find here. Now we're encountering a really nice, luscious kelp field here. At a depth of 160. Gorgeous. And as the sun comes up on a gorgeous Tuesday morning. This is amazing footage I got here. Very, very interesting. So let, let's keep on going. Let's just keep on trucking. Nothing here. We have found anything else. Looks like it's pretty, pretty usual self stuff. Turn off the lights. We have something off the fucking poor bow. Uh, what is that? Is that a giant oyster? Oh, it's just more, uh, more hard, hard coral. The fish back it up into my propeller. Sushi. 
so where I want to go is next to the pier, which is up ahead. And there's... You can see that the sewage jumps right under it. It's very disgusting. It's very telling that humans are disgusting human beings. Uh, compared to chimpanzees, are not that disgusting. Uh, but this... Whoa, whoa, we got some, uh, we got some sharp edges here, maybe. Uh, very, very, very telling. Look at this, look at this concrete structure. Why is it, never mind, it's fine. It's just, uh, weird, right? You never see straight lines in nature. You never do. If you do, it, it's aliens or man-made. It's aliens or man-made. It's neither, it's, it can't be made by chimpanzees. Chimpanzees lack the, the hand-eye coordination to to perform delicate work like that. So it's aliens or human beings. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got something here. We might get a little, little cave here. See if we can find any aliens or chimpanzees in here. Turn on the high beams. Let them know that we're not fucking around. Nothing. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like we have some more uh, is that wreckage? No, it's more, more coral. The, oh, that's a giant soft coral, um, plant there, or, uh, coral, soft coral. Very interesting. We have, we're finding abundance of soft coral. Very interesting. Maybe because of the nutrients from the poop, from the sewer? This is all soft coral. That's hard and soft coral. Uh, this is uh, kelp and algae. Here we're coming up on the pier. Maybe we can uh, find some stuff here. And then wrap it up. Uh, wrap it up. This video, I, I, I'm still amazed. Maybe no, maybe we'll go back to that thing and see if we can get in there in some way, and hope for the best of luck on me. So this is where the sewage comes in, dumps in from uh, Los Santos. It's uh, very disgusting. So it goes all the way back in there. Uh, is there an alien in there? Oh, wait, no. This this doesn't. This is not even. It's broken right over there. I think. Yeah. This has been sealed off. Okay, well, this is the old pier. Again, they have weird... It's weird. Very weird. They have built a pier on top of other piers. Very interesting find I'm finding here. Very scary. Aliens, maybe? Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, so we're, we're getting into a more popular part of the beach, and we're starting to get a little bit more murky. Here we find more remnants of an older pier. Yeah, it's... it's I can't even see anymore. So, I, I, as we can see here, we've, we've driven some far away, um, coming up from that... Uh, Oh, where did I come from? This right here. So, nice, nice look at the big chunk. There's not much here, it's just nothing but pollution. Um, so let's, let's try to see if that's a thing I can get into, uh, for science. And, uh, maybe we can, we can do some studies on that, if I can name it five. So we're just gonna beeline to it. I'm gonna put a waypoint on my GPS so I know where it is. Yeah, uh, thank you for keeping it uh, while we join me on this uh, lovely, lovely adventure through uh, time and space, and what I call. The world of San Andreas. Um, I might do more of these, but uh, depending on uh, my my producers, um, this is very interesting. This is very weird to have this trench here. 
Um, uh, I heard some people heard, they can do wombats down these these trenches. Uh, I heard a guy talk about that. Oh wow, what is this pinnacle right here? This is a, a pinnacle. What a pinnacle is is like a like a uh, like a jettison of a uh, Jesus. This is huge. A jettison of some sort of rock formation, uh, lava, coral, or something, and it jettisons straight up uh, from deep water, uh, and uh, very interesting, very telling of maybe an alien ship under here, this is weird, whoa, there's a cave down there, we're gonna go down there, whoa, come on Betsy, very weird that this is here, um, is there a cave down there, there is, we're going into places people haven't been in ever. Can I fit in there? I don't think so. Let's let's see if I can. Uh oh. There we go. Very weird rock formation on the sounding maps. This doesn't appear. Um, this appears like a regular gradation of the of the thing but it doesn't record this this uh, pinnacle I think um, I am 175 feet down and it, it and it says that I should be this is should be deeper than the stuff to the uh, to the starboard of me and then look at this drop very interesting drop it's a it, it's a it's a deep drop So let's go back to that uh, that station we found or something. Interesting, in very interesting plateau or uh, uh, find. I'm, I'm, I'm finding all sorts of crazy stuff in this environment that we call San Andreas, where uh, 40 million people uh, vacation to this uh, to this island. 40 million people uh, call this place uh, a vacation place. So very, very telling. Uh, again, very weird. We're coming up on the right. Whoa. Okay, back up. We're finding an anomaly here that we shouldn't be finding on this cliff. So what we have here, when you see, when you look, go to the beach and you see like little dibble, like kind of like a wave formation on the, the, the sand, the bed sand. You know, you go to any beach, even on river. It is because the water current creates that. This shouldn't happen like this. So what ha This is a surface that it's rock now. It's not sand because the gravity would pull it down if it was sand. Um, and it, and uh, it does look like some sort of current passed over it, and then maybe solidified it. I don't know. It's very very interesting fi finding these anomalies that do not make sense. Um, but San Andreas, um, it always seems to amaze me. So, uh, we're coming up on here, it looks like, on that, uh, platform I found. Um, my GPS doesn't give coordinates, which is, uh, whoa, is this something here? This is some more rock formation, very, very telling of a, kind of a, Erosion event through water, but we're so deep. This is this is real deep water. Okay, we're in that. Okay. There we go. Okay, here we are. Kind of an abandoned area. There's no fish. There's very. Oh, did I check this down? Yeah, I did check deeper. Oh my God. I did not press that. I did not press that. Oh shit. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. Oh fuck. I'm not gonna make it. I, uh, my controller seems to screw up, so, uh, anyways. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna, it's gonna spawn me back at the, uh, oh, maybe I can do it. Maybe I can do it. Mmm. Oh my god, holy fucking shit. Holy fucking shit.
Oh my god. I'm fucking way out in the middle of fucking nowhere. And it, once I... It would spawn me at the beach and this thing would despawn. There's rough water out here too. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Down bubble. That had to be... Well, how deep was that? Uh, another word of advice. Don't do that in real life. Oh my god. Jesus crap, I'm an Olympic Simber. I swam... It was probably right here. Uh, 200 feet straight up. And... Less than a minute. And didn't my lungs didn't explode. So, here's the plan. Um, we're gonna we're gonna jettison out again. This way, maybe. Let's see here. Okay, we're gonna go in there and see what's in there, and let's go. Oh god. Oh. Ah. There is nothing in here. There's bubbles. Uh there's is that some weird sort of Huh. This doesn't seem to be anything in here. I seem to be trapped. Nope. Very interesting that this is here. Uh there is some life here. Uh I was expecting more. But Thank you for watching the series on World of Los Santos. Um, please sub hit subscribe, like, favorite your video. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to start off my YouTube channel. Um, not a big deal. But uh, again, thanks for uh, how do you, action eat snack. Um, thanks for watching. You stay classy, San Diego.